some parts of the area. We'll go straight to meteorologist Carrie Allen in the First Alert Forecast Center with what we can expect tonight. Carrie. Well, Brittany, as expected, we had severe weather kind of scattered across the South Plains. Other areas, some areas didn't have any rain at all. We saw some of that earlier across portions of the South Plains, but we still have some severe thunderstorm warnings that are still in effect, mainly around O'Donnell. So let's start with a look at the radar view. And that storm is still severe and it's still something that we have to keep a close eye on because a little bit of a notch in there. Uh, so we may have still the potential for very large hail and the possibility for wind gusts that could exceed 60 to 70 miles per hour. That warning still continues. It's been kind of a straggler as far as the rest of the storms are concerned. They pushed out of our area, but this one is still capable of producing some large hail, damaging winds, and just enough to keep an eye on there just in case uh, a little bit of rotation showing up, uh, but overall we're hoping that this storm continues to weaken and will push off to the east. We did have one report of a tornado near uh, Hermley in Scurry County. We understand, at least at this hour, that roads, roads are still blocked along US 84 between Snyder and Roscoe. So if you had plans to travel in that direction, uh, we may have some issues there because we understand the roads are blocked, power lines may be down, phone lines as well. So let's go ahead and take a look at your forecast coming up. I expect temperatures to actually climb back in the upper 80s and uh, end up in the 50s for overnight lows. Most of the severe weather tracks out of our region and then a cold front moves in to drop our temperatures a tad Tuesday. And after we get through tonight, our next chance of storms will likely come Wednesday into Thursday. It's a low chance right now, but it's there nonetheless. And it is the season for severe weather too. So that means there probably will be a little bit of a severe risk. And then it gets hot with highs in the middle 90s by Saturday and Sunday. Next weekend looking pretty warm. Brittany. All right. Thanks so much, Carrie. And don't forget to download our